He vowed he would return someday, and tonight Garth Brooks makes good on that promise with his concert at the Bryce Jordan Center. He was there 18 years ago, and this afternoon he talked about being back in Center County where he was greeted by a special visitor. And with more on the story, Gary Sinderson joins us live from our Center County newsroom. Gary? Yes, Garth Brooks is back, and as you'll see here in a bit, he's very, very happy to be back here at Penn State. Now, starting tonight and over the next two weekends, Garth Brooks is playing six concerts at the Bryce Jordan Center. But first this afternoon, it was a trip down memory lane for one of the music world's most beloved entertainers. Um, Among those on hand to see Garth Brooks this afternoon at a press conference, Emily Allegar State College, the 2014 Grange Fair Queen presenting Brooks with a picnic basket of Grange Fair treats and souvenirs. Even though it was more than two decades ago, Brooks remembers playing the Grange Fair on a Friday night early on in his career. Memories of the Grange Fair? Oh my gosh. Uh, again, eating, uh, which is fantastic, the food. But you got to remember, Pennsylvania and Ohio were tied for our biggest fan club state, even over Texas or Oklahoma, uh, where I'm from. So we played every little county fair, Every place that would have us here in Pennsylvania, and uh, some of the greatest, some of the greatest memories of my life and my career. This is a return trip to the Bryce Jordan Center for Brooks. He was last year, 18 years ago, and says it's still one of his favorite music venues. Just get ready. I mean, it's it's like an oasis in the desert, man, because this place is out all on its own. But it's just it's so full of life. Even driving every day to the gig. You just see how much things are buzzing. Like in my university, which I love my university, you'll see two or three things going on maybe. And you'll see the parents of those kids out watching them or whatever. Here, 20 or 30 things going on, and the stands are full for each one of them, which makes me think there's nothing but love here and a lot of support. Brooks is currently on what's termed the World Tour, which he says may eventually be one of the longest concert tours in music history. He says one of the most enjoyable features, he's playing many of the dates with his wife, Tricia Yearwood. Garth Brooks covering a lot of subjects this afternoon. Two of his favorite entertainers, Tony Bennett and George Strait. He thinks Lady Gaga is a great singer, and he wouldn't mind doing a tune someday with Bruno Mars. Now we'll have much more with Garth Brooks as he kicks off his concert series tonight at the Bryce Jordan Center. We'll have that coming up at 6. Live in Center County, Gary Sanderson, 6 News.